Good morning, everyone. It is currently 7.17, Monday, January 9th, and I'm up. I am awake. Why, you might ask? Because it's the start of the new quarter, and I'm trying out a new routine for the new year's. I got myself a gym membership. I'm thinking of actually going to the gym and using it because I want to get my money's worth, especially when my schedule isn't too hectic yet. However, it is currently raining outside. The weather app said that it is light rain. It is not light rain. And the bad thing is, is that when I was cleaning out my car over winter break, I forgot to put my umbrella back in. So I need to go buy a new umbrella, but it's okay. Target is close to the gym, which means I just have to go to the gym. I can't skip. So I'm gonna get ready and I'll go there. not even look like light rain like hello anyways headed to my car oh that's a huge ass pedal i think the goal is to be back here and like showered and everything and able to eat breakfast in the dining halls and the dining halls closed for breakfast at 10 a.m it is currently a little past 7 30 maybe 7 45 ish where did i park my car Never mind, I found it. My feet are already wet. This is unfortunate. I guess the good thing about coming early when it's absolutely pouring is that the gym is pretty much empty. Gotta run to Target to grab an umbrella. Unfortunately, they are sold out. Sold out of umbrellas. All of this water running. So right now, housekeeping closes the bathroom from 9 to 10. And I forgot about that because they didn't do that over break. Um, so I'm gonna go eat. I'm gonna go eat and then hopefully by the time I come back here, we're all good to go. I can go take a shower. But holy shit, it is pouring outside. <laughs> Okay, so one of my professors emailed that they had finally opened up the Canvas site for our class. Um, I hate it when professors do things last minute. Like, I I was literally like, oh my god, come on. Like, just send us the syllabus. Literally, just email us the syllabus before the quarter starts. But, you know, the, at least they gave us slightly over 24 hours to review what we need to do for class. Okay, I just peeked my head out and I saw that the bathroom is now open. So I'm gonna go take a shower and I'll catch y'all once I do that. Okay, I have around like less than 15 minutes to get ready and do my makeup because my class starts soon. All my classes this quarter are like semi, semi close to like where I live. So it's not like too bad, but like, I want to get there early, a little, get a good seat and everything, but I also don't want to get caught in the rain. We're just going to do a really simple makeup routine today because, you know, who is going to be looking? I'm going to be wearing my mask for a majority of the day too. Nobody's really going to see anything. All they're going to see is my eyes. The first class I have today is physics. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. Like, I did not like high school physics. Hopefully, I remember something from four years ago because that's the last time I took physics. I'm gonna get ready. I am literally so wet right now. Like, I stepped out and like my shoes immediately got drenched. I just had the shortest lecture ever. I literally sat down and watch my professor like low-key space out for a minute and then he he basically went like 
I'm not feeling good, so class is canceled. First things first, I hope he feels better soon. But like, huh? I literally got soaked just to be told that we don't have class. Okay, just got out of Ochem lecture. School may or may not be canceled tomorrow because of unsafe driving conditions. So they're like, we don't want you to drive in this way, rain and everything. My feet are literally drenched still. Everything was just wet, but I'm running back to the building and I need to deal with some work stuff. Okay, so I am back in my room. First things first, um, I need to change. Everything on me is wet. Like I had a check, I have a check in my pocket and dude, it's literally sort of drenched. I hope I can still cash it, but most definitely my shoes and socks, they need to go. They need to like, they need their moment to dry off. Whenever I move like my foot, I can feel like the puddle of water in my shoe. So we need to deal with that. LOL. So because of all the rain, my class tomorrow is going to be online. My other two classes were already supposed to be online. So not much of a difference, but, but that means I technically don't have to like go to class tomorrow. Well, technically I do, but it's like online. Also because of the rain, I don't want to go out and eat tonight to like the dining hall because I already blow dried my pants to be dry. Like I don't want to have to blow dry them again. So I'm going to eat my very special comfort meal, my teriyaki noodle bowl. I already snacked and finished my bag of shrimp chips, which I probably shouldn't do because I like undid my entire workout this morning, but whatever. This with seaweed and chili crisp, it's a match made in heaven. So I'm gonna go make this, watch a little TV, and then watch the lecture, like the physics lecture that I was supposed to have today, but my professor canceled like a minute into class. So that's the plan for tonight. Hopefully I can get to bed by like, oh wait, I'm on duty tonight. Never mind. I will be going to bed at like midnight. I was gonna do homework, but then I got sidetracked with TikTok, but now it's time for a duty walk. So I'm gonna go do that real quick. Our building is low-key flooding, low-key. I'm also gonna check on the leak in the roof um, that I already called emergency maintenance, but I just wanna make sure like, to see if it actually has been fixed yet. I don't think it is because apparently a lot of things are sort of breaking down around campus and we're on the queue, but I don't know if we're up first. Got my keys, have my polo on. Oh, I need my name tag. Put it on my name tag, then I'll be good to go. I literally was gonna go take a shower. Like I literally stripped, like I, I stripped and then the duty phone rang and I had to pick it up and I had to put back on my clothes to go do my job. Like I love the free housing. I love this room, sort of, it's really humid in here. And I love the free meal plan because it saves me money, but it's the little things. It's the little things that drive me insane. Like today already was not a good day. I found ants in my Brita after I drank all the water. It's raining, it's pouring. Everything's flooding. The building is literally falling apart. I'm like gonna go take a shower and cry before I have to do another duty walk. It's like nine. I need to get up and return the duty phone. I need to give that phone away. I'm just gonna do that and get ready for the day. Even though there's no classes cause they all got canceled because of the weather. Uh, Canvas. So it's a little bit of an my class so we're has like a thousand people sure in our lecture. Well Zoom with, can only uh, handle 300 people. Canvas. Um, so the academic but coordinators it's recorded are so and I was gonna skip, to to but I signed on and I was like, oh shit, issues, we're actually like covering said, content today. So I guess I'm just gonna like get ready and then figure this out later. The plans for today have changed a little. I'm picking up my Ortega order and then I need to go pick up my mail. Number two, the post office. I have secured my package. If you're wondering what my package is, over break, I shipped clothes here. So, more athletic clothes. I forgot to do something for work last night and to turn it in by 10 a.m. So I'm doing it right now. It's a couple hours late, 
but hopefully it's okay. Honestly, so much happened last night that I honestly wanted to die. Okay, so I managed to do what I need to do. I submitted my report and everything. Now it is time for lunch. I will be eating my lunch. If you all are wondering what I got, I got the same thing I always get. There is no variation. I am nothing if not consistent. I got my house salad with balsamic vinaigrette as my sign. I got a banana as my fruit. I got the dessert from the cowboy cookie bar. And I got barbecue chicken with potato wedges. I'm gonna take a lunch break and then we're gonna go back to doing some work and rescheduling my whole entire thing because let's just say this week is not going the way I thought it would go and it's low-key gone worse than I thought it would go but that's okay it's only week one there's always room for improvement okay I just finished watching my physics lecture so I'm gonna open this package and see what I've bought I bought workout clothes and I like spent all of my like built up credit on it damn there's a lot of stuff in here hold on the one that I'm looking forward to the most was this pair of shorts because I have some but I wear like running shorts a lot because I normally like go to sleep in them they're just nice and comfy see that that looks cute sort of see-through ish like, hold on. Like, I mean, sorta. But I mean, it, ha it does have a liner in here, which is like, okay. I like this one the most. I also haven't opened anything else, but I also got a jacket because I don't have any like zip up jackets. I mostly just have hoodies. So I got one, if I can open this. This is a zip up jacket. So it's like a lemon-ish jacket. It's black. Cause most of my like sports jackets are like blue, but I'll try it on. Mm. I got it in a small one. So I don't think it's I'm pretty sure it'll fit. Mm. Oh, it has the little thumb things. I look like a runner? Do I look like like a soccer mom? I'm, I'm literally cosplaying as like every single Asian mom. I have like the hair color and everything. Like next thing, I'm just gonna be like, oh, I don't know what this thing is for though. Interesting, interesting. I like this. I'm gonna try on the rest of the clothes that I got off camera and then I'm gonna go run some errands because there's so much to do this week. I sort of hate it. <laughs> I made my way downtown because I need to go to the hospital to pick up my volunteer badge because I'm starting my volunteering again this week because I'm back from break. Secured my badge. There's my little photo in the corner. Okay, since I'm back, I'm gonna drop this off in my desk and then I'm gonna go for a little walkie walk. She's so pretty. Also, I got the audiobook for Ari Shaw in the End of Time because it really does not seem like I'm picking up the physical book anytime soon. Like, I literally read, like, two pages and then I, like, fall asleep. Not because the book is bad, but because I'm exhausted. So, I got the audiobook. I low-key probably should start from the beginning all over again because I don't remember what's happened. Like, I put the book down for, like, two weeks. Like, I didn't use a bookmark, so then I forgot where I was and then, like, I randomly opened the book to, like, a page I thought I left off on. Yeah, so I should really just start from the beginning. Something about the way that you understand. We don't need a rush and we don't need to make no plan. Mm -mm. You say, pace yourself, so it down. but it's almost 11.30. It is time to go to bed. Good morning, everyone. It's like 
720. I'm planning to go to the gym again, but also like I already feel so behind on schoolwork and it's like only the third day of the quarter. But I'm hoping to leave here by 7.45. My pre-workout snack is my bowl of strawberries. Just got out of class, I'm going to eat, but why is the line so long? Also, thoughts on physics. Um, my professor is low-key disorganized. He's funny, he makes me giggle, but it's like sort of a nightmare to take notes in his class. I like sort of got that when I was watching the online lecture because our first class got canceled. So the other ones don't have pyridine in them. So we don't see that in our HBR, but we do see it in the PBR screen. Oh no. So I just finished my OCHEM class. Technically, 10 minutes after my OCHEM class ends, I was supposed to do like the CLAS for OCHEM, but it's all the way across campus in IV. I just don't have the energy for that today. Like I really don't. And my bike, I don't have my bike fixed until Friday. So I'm skipping it today. I'm just gonna ask my friend for notes. And I literally was like falling asleep in class. My eyes were like shut for half of that class. Hopefully I like recharge a little, but oh my God. Week one, I'm always exhausted on week one, but there's just so much to do. So instead of napping, I might get a little of that done. So I can just go to bed early. Who knows? My other friend dropped out. Do you want to go see Harry Styles? I was like, how much is it? She's like, $90. I was like, $90? Yeah. Post or a meeting Korean pair. Mm, I have a couple things of homework I need to do before I go to bed. And I'm not feeling as tired as it was this afternoon. So hopefully I'm able to finish my bio quiz and finish my physics lab and start my chem homework. Who knows about the chem homework though? And the physics lab, TBH, because I don't really don't want to do the physics lab. It is due soon though. I'm gonna eat this, watch an episode of my C drama, sort of just relax a little, take care of myself, and then I'm gonna go take a shower. Okay, I literally was about to take my bio quiz again to try and get 100%. My residence knock on my door. I should stop, I should stop answering my door, but my residence knock on my door. They serenade me, huh? I literally was just standing there like with my glasses on, like on my phone record, like recording it, which I sent to my friends on Snapchat. I literally was just like, what the fuck is happening? It's nine, it's almost 9.30 guys. This week has been too long, much too long. I saw you inside, it was a cold tonight. You showed me the friend talks good morning everyone it is thursday we are almost done with week one just today and friday i only have one class today um it is my evolution and ecology class that starts in like a half an hour so i'm getting ready and then after that i have to i'm going to go volunteer at the hospital not quite sure exactly how much work i'll be able to get done today and also like some of my residents have been texting me saying that they want to talk so it seems like today is going to be another pretty busy day i think it should be fine um also update while i was at the gym i was listening to arusha again um, and I got past where I had left off when I was actually like physically reading the book. Now I only have like three hours left on the audiobook, but again, I'm still going at like the 2.25 the speed for my audiobook. So really that's like an hour and a half. Hopefully I'll finish it either like today or tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm not going to the gym. I'm going to go work out Bonnie because she wants to swim and I haven't swam with her in a while and I like kept saying that I would and I never did last quarter so we're actually doing it this quarter like I'm a I'm a follow through on that but yeah I'm getting ready as fast as I can because class is sort of far away from me this time it's probably gonna take like a 10-15 minute walk and I want to get there slightly early also I'm going to order um Ortega which is like the takeout service here um, while I'm in class so that I can pick it up right after class, eat, and then like go volunteer. So I'm not starving today. 
made it to my EMB2 class. I'm waiting for my friend to show up. I literally have to leave for my volunteer shift in like 10 minutes, but lunch, we're doing a quick one. I'm gonna pack a banana to go to the hospital because I feel like I'm gonna get hungry after eating this because I was already hungry during lecture and I'm only eating a salad. This is not gonna hold me over. Okay, so um, I left volunteering early because my time slot is not one of the actual time slots that they have. I'm just like, since there are already two people volunteering after me, like there are already two people who come on in my like third hour, I'm good. Like it's okay, I don't need to stay the full time. Um, so I'm just gonna email them back and change my hours to shorten it by one because why would I be there if there's nothing for me to do? So I'm going back a little, little bit early, an hour earlier than expected. Actually, really only half an hour earlier than expected. So I'm gonna like decompress a little before I have to go meet with my resident. Um, maybe do some homework. Okay, my meeting with my resident went a lot quicker than I thought it would. Um, and since I don't know if there's a club meeting tonight, I'm just gonna go to the study room that one of the other RAs reserved and like just hammer out some of my lab homework because there's so much to do already. But before that, I'm gonna do instant noodles for dinner with an egg, maybe two, and then we'll skirt on over to the library. We are studying in the library tonight. I haven't been here since literally ages. I did not come here at all last quarter. So, it's like my first time actually like, spending a significant period of time here since freshman year. When I decided to make you mine, I'm never going back. Good morning, everyone. It is almost 8 a.m. I was in the bathroom, and my husband was like, Oh, Hannah, do you have an 8 a.m.? I was like, No, I'm going swimming. And they're like, Why? That's a great question. Why am I going swimming in like 50 degree weather on an 8 a.m. on a Friday when I could be sleeping or going to a gym? that has like climate control. But swimming, I have to get wet. Anyways, it also looks like I'm gonna be there first and she's gonna be a little, little late, but I am currently by Phelps. It's right behind me in South Hall, um, but I'm almost there. I have like maybe five minutes left of this walk. Last night, I finished Arusha on the end of time. I finished my audiobook, So I need to know what to start next. I'm getting my bike fixed. But some people, and I figured I probably shouldn't. Hello, everyone. It is Friday evening. I am currently watching this C drama, Flight to You, and texting my mom about it. It is very good. I am on episode 33. If anyone wants to hear my sea drama opinions, let me just know. This is my first one, but I have a couple lined up after this that I'm planning to watch. Over break, I got hooked, absolutely hooked onto sea dramas um, and just Chinese media in general. I normally wasn't, like I was very much like a, a K-drama anime type girly, but now I'm hooked onto sea dramas. Actually, it's sort of late right now. It's like almost 10 o'clock. I'm gonna be going to bed soon. So I think it's like good that I'm getting back in like the groove of editing and everything again. So we're doing great. But um, thank you so much for watching this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Stay fresh and I'll catch you next time.